I just had, so I've had the fifth person who is um, supportive of the former president tell me not to undermine the story of crossover Democrats. Look, I'm just looking at the numbers, okay? I, every storyline's as good as any other for us. You know, we're just trying to drive what matters here. But the party change numbers from New Hampshire as of the October 8th deadline, remember, if you're a Democrat and you want to vote for Haley to mess with Trump, Fine. You had to do it by October 6th. Right. Okay? They have the numbers. Um, Democrat to undeclared, right? 3,500. That's what it is. Democrat to Republican, 400. That's 3,900 votes. They're saying you're going to have over 300,000 votes. The idea that that's the difference maker here, you better hope not. Yeah. It's not the difference maker. Well, we shall see. Hey, up. but I'm saying look, they're coming at me about it, look, it. So well, it's something on their mind. We'll have to see what the yeah. number, the final numbers are. We don't know, you know. If it gets Which means close. I don't know that you get a, an Iowa speech out of Trump because the Iowa speech was a very rare event because everything went his way and everybody was nice Listen, to him. Listen, if he wins, even if he only wins by 5%, he will still be the only Republican since 1976 to win both the Iowa caucus yes, and the New Hampshire primary. but he won't be meeting expectations. No, he won't. And that's what he's going to be concerned about. And she will be, if she manages to lose by less than 10%, she will be emerging from New Hampshire with I a lot think of it's got, I, you, you know, think it's got to be more yeah, like Yeah, I think it's got to be 8 or 9%. Yeah, that's better than expected, but I don't know if that's enough for I A lot of people were talking about her winning. Yeah, that, that's the thing. It's, I but, think she's got to be within five. But, but the, I don't think the media does that to Nikki Haley. The, well, no, the media is going to be very know, supportive they, of they Nikki Haley. they want her in the race. Right, no, right. no, absolutely. So if she you gets, know. you know, 11, they're going to say, well, you know, the polls said 19 right. uh, day before. That's so, not true. Yes, it is true. It is true. The, well, the, we'll see. Yeah, the, we'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Well, we're not, we're not, we, won't, out. Yeah. we won't be able to watch other media, so we won't see. Hello. You got one of these? Yeah, I know, but you know, we won't be able to you watch these, as it's like live as it's online, I'm, I'm, whatever you're I'm doing. I'm watching the same we'll, stuff. We'll, yeah, we'll I'm sitting here. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to chat with our watch party, and we're going to, he's upset about that. He's going to yeah. hit me in the break. Yeah. And we're going to speak with Trump's former campaign manager, Corey Lewandowski. That's going to be a great window into the Trump mindset. Stay with us. Hey, thank you for watching. Please go to newsnationnow.com, newsnationnow.com, and you can find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button down below. Then you will get more of News Nation's fact-driven coverage.